Is there a silent enemy lurking within your website secretly trying to sabotage your search engine optimization? That's the essence of our question today. Are stock photos bad for my website? Can stock photos hurt my SEO? So oftentimes when I speak to groups, I will show two images. And one image is a fancy looking photo of a perfect family out in front of a perfect house, the lighting is amazing. And the other photo, family in it looks more real, the house behind them isn't so perfect. And I will ask, you know, which one of these images do you think got more clicks and engagement? So we took both of these images and we tested them in some A-B tests, both on Facebook and a website. And as you may suspect, the real image actually got more traction than the other image. And sometimes that surprises us because it looks so much less professional, but we all know what that other image is. It's a stock photo. You can tell when you see a stock photo. It's easy to identify a stock photo. It's perfect, the lighting is great. We've all seen stock photos on websites, on billboards, all over the place. And the problem with stock photos is that they are not authentic. You can tell they're stock photos. When someone comes to your website, you want them to see your real products and services. You want them to see photos of your team members that are actually real. No one's gonna be fooled by those stock photos. So we always suggest to our clients, use real photos when possible, both on websites and in social media. It simply gives a better experience. Google's former head of web spam, Matt Cutts, once stated that stock photos don't currently harm a site search results. However, he was quick to mention, that's a great suggestion for the future signal that we could look at in terms of search quality. Google does often penalize websites that use duplicate copy. We see that all the time. And with Google's dedication to providing web pages with original content, it's not a stretch to think that we will see the same focus soon extend to images. In many cases, showing a photo that exists on other websites could be considered a lesser experience for users since it's not a unique, fresh, original experience. And we suspect it's possible that Google could look at stock images that exist elsewhere on the web as a negative in the future and possibly demote those pages in search that feature them. So is it always wrong to use stock photos? No, sometimes you have to do so. If you need an image of a mountain, for instance, and don't quite have the time to head out to Colorado and take one for yourself, might be a good time to use a stock photo. But if you're able, try to use original images, even if they're not as professional looking as those fancy stock photos. Your website and your social media will look more authentic and you'll likely see better results. Thanks, and I'll see you next time.